two dozen minis, a dozen short, and two dozen long is the next order. Staff at this umbrella warehouse have There's never been busier. Time. The company supplies umbrellas to hundreds of retailers, these days moving 10,000 a week. It's just been rapid fire of getting umbrellas into the stores and they're, they're, they're leaving the stores as quickly as they are going in. While Vancouver is known for its rain, the specific weather system responsible for this week's flooding is becoming more common. We have seen an overall increase in the number of atmospheric rivers in Western Canada. An atmospheric river is a large, narrow stream of water vapor in the atmosphere. It can stretch on for kilometers, and climate scientists say we can expect to see more of them. A warmer atmosphere can hold more water vapor, and so um, that is a, a signature of climate change on Canada's climate that we um, are starting to see and we expect to intensify going forward. Atmospheric rivers are a part of this region's natural cycle. They supply up to 90% of the yearly precipitation for the Pacific Northwest, and they're critical in maintaining Canada's water supply. But they can be problematic. We really saw the impacts of what happens when we get consecutive storms one after another. That's what contributed to the Fraser Valley flooding this time and the historic floods here of 2021. Experts say governments need to be prepared. Um, there needs to be a lot of planning and redesigning of infrastructure so our bridges, our dams can accommodate greater flood levels. Seven more orders to do. Back at the Umbrella Warehouse, this prolonged wet weather is extending their peak season. So our high season really can start October and we can run all the way through now until the end of May. For them, a shifting business model based solely on the forecast. Tanya Fletcher, CBC News, Vancouver.